I'm going to show you how to use Zoom to share and record your phone screen. And this method works on both Android and iPhone. So are you ready? Hey, go-getter, it's Salma Jafri from salmajafri.com and you are in the right place if you want to grow your personal brand with video. Be sure to hit the red subscribe button and the bell icon and let's begin. Now, sharing your phone screen is a great way to show tutorials on your phone screen. And so today I'm gonna to show you how to use both iPhone as well as Android to share your phone screen using Zoom absolutely for free. Now, before we get started, remember that if this is your first introduction to Zoom, I do have a Zoom beginners tutorial, which I'll link to right here and also at the end. So you can go and watch that. And also this video is part of a series I'm doing on how to start an online business. So I'm gonna to link to the entire series up here as well. And also at the end, so make sure you're watching the entire series to start an online business. All right, so to share your phone screen, you need two devices ideally. So you need your laptop and you need your phone. Now I'm first going to show you how to do this with your iPhone and then I'm gonna show you how to do it with your Android phone. All right, let's start. So I'm gonna open up my laptop. So the first thing we're gonna do is open up Zoom and we're gonna start a new meeting by clicking on new meeting, hey. Now, the next thing I wanna show you is that you wanna go here and click share. And simply, if you have an iPhone or an iPad, then what you need to do is connect that via a USB cable to your laptop. And then you can go and click this button which says iPhone, iPad via cable. And then you can start to share your iPhone screen. If you do not have a cable, you can use AirPlay to do that as well and so that's how simple it is for iPhone users so you start up zoom you start a meeting and then you go to screen share and then you click either iPhone via cable or iPhone via airplay and then you click the share button now since I have an Android device what I'm going to show you is how to use um, how to share your Android phone screen on your laptop and you can do this during a meeting you can do it live you can record this and you can share it as well. So uh, you can do this without a cable as well. So let me show you how to do that. The first thing you need to do again is to start a meeting. Now I already have this meeting and we're already recording it. So the first two steps are the same. And then now what you're gonna do is invite yourself into this meeting, okay? So you're gonna go click on the invite and then I usually just use email or you can send yourself the meeting ID. So I will just email myself a link to join this meeting. So what I'm gonna do is send an email to myself and click send. Now, what I'm going to do is accept the invitation that I just sent to myself on my phone. There it is. All right, so once you've received the invitation on your phone, you're going to go and join the Zoom meeting from your phone. And then I'm gonna say open with Zoom, yes. And then you're gonna be able to share your screen from your phone. So I'm gonna go and click on share. And then it says Zoom will start capturing everything that's displayed on your screen. Start now. And then I'm going to be sharing everything that's on my screen. So if I wanna show, for example, my YouTube analytics here, I can show this. If I wanna show something on some other app, like let's say Canva, I can go here and show this. So you can do all sorts of tutorials and stuff from here. You can show whatever you are uh, showcasing. For example, if I want to show you how to use TubeBuddy on Android, I can go sign in here and show you that. So you can do all of this and you can uh, record as you're showing it. So you can either share it live or you can be recording this. So you can also enable or disable your video on the side. So if you just want the screen share to be showing for the purposes of recording a video, so you can just simply go here to stop video and it'll remove the video and now you just have a screen share that you can use. You can also make this full screen by going to view options and then uh, clicking either 100% or exiting full screen. Or uh, you can uh, zoom in, make it like 150%, 300%, whatever you wanna do with this, right? So you have all of these options and right now it's recording everything on the screen as well. So this is a great way to be able to share your phone screen without really downloading anything very specific on your phone, but you can use your laptop to do it, which I, gives, which I think gives you a lot more screen uh, space to do it 
in. All right, so for all of this to work, there's only one setting that you need to tweak. And I'm gonna show you how to do that. So you wanna go to zoom.us and then go into your settings. And then you wanna scroll all the way down to where it says screen sharing, right? And then here inside who can share, you wanna click on all participants and who can start sharing when someone else is sharing. Also, you can decide whether to click on all participants or not, but this is really the crucial one, the first one, who can share. So that way, when you invite yourself into a Zoom meeting, you're, so you're the host on your laptop, but you're the participant on your phone and you've enabled screen sharing. So that's the only setting you need to enable for this whole thing to work. If you have any other questions about how to use Zoom or any other questions about starting your online business, drop them in the comments below and maybe I'll make a video on that next. If you wanna start your YouTube channel and teach online like I do, then you wanna watch my YouTube masterclass to start on how to use a YouTube channel to build an online business. You can go to salmajafri.com forward slash subscribe to watch that masterclass. And I'll also put the link down in the description below. So you can go click that. Remember to go after what you want and build the brand you love because you can be the medium.